What is meditation? I prefer to speak about practice of silence. Why? Meditation is to step back and observe your thoughts. If you apply distancing, which is to unify three fields of perception, the weight of your body, what you see, what you hear, you zoom back, you see this little mechanical device who makes you zap from vision to audition to feeling the body, and after a while you unify the three fields into one. When you do that, your thoughts are further away. You are already getting into the practice of silence. You're not fully identified with your thoughts. There is a distance with them. Meditation is to practice silence, is to disengage from your thinking process. What advantage do you get by doing that? The more you step back, the more you will not be taken by the lure, which will be at the origin of your repetitive pattern, which usually are compensatory structure linked to what is not process, which usually at the are at the origin of losing choices. Because it's life, it's binary. Winning, losing, winning, losing. And a part of you knows in advance where it's going to be losing, where it's going to be winning. So that's why it's very important to step back and do nothing. But to step back and do nothing, you have to be silent. So when you meditate, when you practice silence, you give yourself an opportunity to make different choices. It's the first thing you gain. And in time, you will develop subtle sensation, the sensation of your upper part. You feel that in the body. Tactile sensation, subtle sensation will come in in your meditation, in your practice of silence. And this is a sign that bit by bit your level of consciousness is rising.